In this video for positive maths, we're going to learn about VAT or VAT. So VAT stands for Value Added Tax. And it's a government tax that's added on to many items that we buy. Most of the time, it's already included in the price. So it's the price of what we're buying plus VAT is equal to the total price. So the total price is what we normally pay. We calculate VAT as a percentage of the price of the item or service that we are purchasing. So we can have VAT added on to normal things that we can buy in the shop or we can have VAT added on to services like getting our hair cut, getting our laundry done, anything like that. All those things are services. So we have already learned how to calculate percentages. So let's see how we apply this to calculating VAT. OK, we saw in bills that VAT can be added on to the end of a bill. In this example, we have a car is priced at €3,000 plus 23% VAT. Calculate the total price of the car. So it's going to be 3000 plus 23%. OK, so we're going to calculate our percentage first. So we'll do that just over to the right. We have 3,000. And just to recap, we have three different ways we can find a percentage. We can find it by using a fraction. So we can multiply it by 23 over 100. We can find it by using a decimal. So multiplying it by 0 0.23. Or we can find it by using the percentage itself. So 3,000 multiplied by 23%. So our answer for all three will be 690. So we're going to have 3,000 plus 690. So we get 3,690. Not forgetting our units. That means the price of the car, 3,600. 90 euro. Okay, just briefly, the other way we can do it is type in 3000 plus 23% into the calculator and we will find our total straight away. Okay, so problem solving. The rate of VAT on electrical goods is 20%. Fill in the missing parts of the table. OK, so we're going to take a few examples. Then you can pause the video and calculate the rest yourselves to practice. OK, so the washing machine, 100% of the price. OK, and then the selling price is going to be 120%. So the washing machine is 300 euro. So it's going to be 300 plus 20%. So our answer will be 360. Okay, the next example. We have the selling price is 60 euro. Okay, for the kettle. But 60 euro is equal to 120%. So we need to find 100%. So first we're going to find 1% by dividing 60 by 120. So 1% is going to be equal to 0 0.5 or a half. And then to find 100%, we're multiplying this by 100. So we get 50 euro. So we'll fill that in here. OK, so pause the video, see if you can find the selling price for the dishwasher, the hoover and the toaster. So you're given your 100% and you need to find your 120%. Then see if you can find the price before VAT is added on for the iron and the television. So you're given 120% and you need to find 100%. Okay, so we can be asked to add VAT onto the total of a bill. 
Our example here is to find the total of the following. So we have two cans of paint, 15 euro each, three brushes, which are 525 each, and rollers, which are 250. Okay, then we're adding on VAT at 20%. So we have 2 multiplied by 15, 3 multiplied by 525, and we have rollers, which are just 250. So we'll just add that on there. Okay, so we're finding our total, first of all. So we're going to have 30 euro for the paint, 15.75 for the brushes, and 250 for our rollers. So our total for those three different things is 48.25. Okay, now we have to add on our 20%. So 48.25 multiplied by 0 0.2 is going to give us our 20%, which is 9.65. So our total is going to be 48.25 plus our 9.65. And we get 57.9. So our total bill then, is 57 euro and 90 cent. For more information, visit www.positivemaths.ie. You can email us at info at positivemaths.ie and find us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you.